सो वेलकम बैक पीपल आई थिंक एवरी वन नाट डूइंग हर्ट सो आई नो वाई यू आर यर बिकॉज यू हैव बिन शिफ्टेड फ्रॉम विंडोज टू लिनक्स और रूबन टू सो यू आर वर्ड अबाउट यूजिंग वॉट माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एक्स एक्सेल और समथिंग लाइक दैट विच सपोर्ट्स विंडोज सो लाइक यू आर नॉट गेटिंग हाउ टू यूज विंडोज अप्लीकेशन एंड रूबन टू सो यू केम फॉर द राइट प्लेस ओके ना लेट से there is two application that uh, runs windows application in ubuntu or linux so one application name is called wine and the other one is called uh, bottle bottles so this is basically the two application which will basically run the windows application okay so let me go by step by step the so first i'll show how to install wine application then i'll go how to install bottle application bottles okay using this too you can basically run any uh, windows application which is ending with .exe files okay now let's jump into the video okay the first thing is that uh, you need to uh, open the terminal okay i just open one okay now we need to run one command which is called uh, this command you need to run so running is command uh, which will basically uh, give the better uh, structure or the architecture for my system okay after running this command you need to run one more command you need to run uh, what uh, this command because uh, you need to run this command because to add the uh, what wine repository keys so you need to have some wine repository keys to make wine to work right so you need to add this uh, <coughs> uh keys and then uh, <coughs> sorry for that and then you need to uh, what you need to download that wine repository keys from the website so i'm using wget okay now i uh, what installed the key after that you need to uh, add the official wine repository so now i added the wine repository keys okay now i need to add the wine repository uh, sorry official wine repository Uh, okay so for that i need to uh, what click this particular link so i'll provide all the links uh, in the descriptions don't worry about the links i'll provide all the links and uh, if you click enter this will basically download the uh, wine uh, repository official wine repository okay so now uh, you need to uh, what install the wine uh, this application so what do you do you need to you need to type this command uh, to install the i guess you can see my screen i guess yeah you need to type this command to install the latest version of uh, wine uh, application if i click enter you can you can see my uh, what application is been downloading okay okay it is taking time okay let's open it okay so uh leave that beside and now i'll just download any windows application which is ending with uh, .txt let me uh, download it i open the what firefox it is opening uh, let's give some time for that okay now it is opening i guess okay now uh, we have firefox okay now what i do um let me say any windows application uh, let's take that uh, um download windows sorry download windows uh telegram okay so this will basically download so if i click this telegram and then mm, okay you can see your telegram for uh, linux okay i don't need for linux i just click on show all platforms so here you can see many platforms and then here you can see get telegram for windows uh this one if i click on that so it will basically download telegram for uh, my uh, linux system you can see the extension uh, let me show you you can see here uh, the extension which i am downloading is uh, ending with uh, .exe you can see here 
okay now it is downloaded uh, now let me close this one and uh, close this one okay i need to download some uh, uh, need to get 304 rk okay let's do that because i did not update my system so you can just forward a little bit of this video so that uh, you don't need to waste your time here so now we are done with the uh, what updates <coughs> okay let me close this uh, let me open my uh, file manager okay so if i go to downloads okay if i go to downloads and you can see one application which is ending with the uh, dot exe uh, right click on that open with the uh, other application you can see one more application here called uh, y in windows program loader so if i click that and uh, if i just select it uh, it will load that application that is our uh, telegram setup will actually uh, load into the wine and then wine will uh, actually uh, load on that i mean uh, wine is just a uh, docker if you know docker you will basically understand this wine uh, easily okay so there is one thing uh, so wine can run on uh, window sorry linux application wine can run on this linux application on that uh, you, wine can run windows application which is ending with dot exe okay that is how you actually run a uh, windows application so basically this windows application is not telling uh, ubuntu os that i am running windows application it is just telling that i am running an application okay so this wine will actually convert all the uh, it, which will actually work like a virtual box it's not totally virtual box it like acts like a uh, some kind of a mediator or something like that and then it will uh, say the ubuntu to run this application and then this uh, windows application will run so that is what the basic understanding which i can say it will take a bit more time so i don't prefer you to uh, use these kind of uh, uh, what windows application to run because uh, like now it's been many years that uh, linux is been uh, developed so there is uh, what linux versions of uh, that particular application you can um, easily use that instead of you running a windows application i am just showing an example how you can run the windows application okay i guess so now it will open yeah now it open so this application is ending with the .txt you can see here .txt but you can see that this application run if i click okay you can see the telegram is running telegram is running okay if i click next 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 so it is basically taking uh, c drive space c drive space it is actually uh, what thinking this as a windows application and this is not a linux application and it is running uh, windows applications you can see uh, telegram is loading now uh, wine is uh, some kind of application which is acting a uh, intermediate between uh, your linux application and windows application so that uh, you can launch the application i guess yeah you can launch that application uh, just a minute yeah you can see here the <laughs> we just run windows application in linux you can see this is ubuntu os and this is windows application if i click enter this is windows application okay so i don't need to run that i'll just close that so this is you run windows application using wine application okay now i'll show you uh, that there is one more application which is called bottles i'll show you how to install that bottles okay i'll just close everything i uh, will use the same application to download it okay i will just close it and i will open the terminal okay now what you need to do you need to use uh, one uh, what library called uh, oh, flat pack sorry flat flat and pack so uh, by default this library or this particular uh, packages is not uh, installed so i need to install it so sudo apt install pack okay so this will basically install the flat pack uh, application okay let me wait for the minute i guess okay now we just uh, installed the what a uh, flat pack now what we do uh, we go for the what uh, firefox okay just i'll cl clear the screen we'll go for the firefox and then 
okay so fly firefox is ready okay now i'll uh, what search for flatab dot uh, org slash and then apps slash and then com dot uh, use bottles dot bottles so this application so flat bags is like a what repository i can say okay this uh, flat pot flat hub okay flat f l a t i am saying flat f l a t yeah flat hub is uh, just a repository i'll just open this in a new terminal and i'll show you okay flat hub is just an uh, repository it's like a store it's like a window store or a ubuntu store where you will have uh, may any kind many kinds of uh, application which you can run on the linux but uh, i need bottles which is one of the most uh, used uh, application okay i need to install it you can see here the flat app has been installed if i go here, and then if i see the downloads you can see here using okay so now you can't download it like that i guess okay now what i do i click on this arrow button you can see here so make sure you follow the step queues for your linux distribution from installing i'll go there or else you can install it directly by using this link so i don't need to do that now uh, i'll choose the os that will be windows and it is saying you need to install the uh, flat app okay i just installed it after that you need to uh, what copy this uh, uh, libraries i need to install some libraries okay okay so after uh, install okay continue idea need to do it okay okay after installing this one i need to install this one okay i'll just copy paste it mm okay just start it like like this only i guess okay i don't need to mess up okay okay now i need to update my system after that i'll provide you a link for this and all okay after that you need to do one more thing which is you need to install the flash flash is already installed but uh, let me install it again okay now it uh, it got some updates okay now install the software package plugin so this is the plugin okay Okay, I need to install the plugins to support uh, my this one. Okay, so after uh, doing that steps and all, so it is saying to restart my system. Okay, I need to do yes. Okay, so now I'll restart my system and then I'll uh, catch you back. So now I just uh, about to restart my system and uh, I try to install that uh, Flask app, but I came across some error which is showing showing like this. Look for matches. So for that, I thought uh, I need to install the Flatup application. So it say there is now an application called Flatup. Then. <clears throat> i actually solved that uh, what problem by using this particular uh, what a link or a url so this will basically uh, what download some uh, uh, what libraries that is which is necessary for uh, installing uh, what any bottles or any applications now you need to uh, type this link so that you can download uh, bottles So this is what uh, the link which you need to type. So you can uh, install the bottle. So if I press enter, so this will basically look for the match, and then it will say you know, you do want to install. Yes, you want to install. Okay. Yes, you want to install. Just give us for everything, and then uh, see if you come across the same error, you can just use uh, this particular link. I'll uh, provide you in the description as well. So this will basically update the what. libraries or the server which will change the server so that you can use it uh, for the updated one for only for 2023 versions okay it is taking time 
so 11 percent 1.7 mb per second finally finally uh it took around 30 minutes to install so i was having a network issue so it took 30 minutes we finally installed it and now i'll just uh, close this terminal okay so for opening bottle you need to click here and uh, you need to search for bottle here so you can see here one new icon which will appear that is called bottles you click on that okay so it will take us uh, some time to open hmm it is taking some time to open i guess okay it will open it is taking some time Okay, now we got the icon here. Yeah, now the bottle uh, application just opened. Windows to bottle, continue. Okay, almost done. And um, okay. So it will take some time, I guess. Uh, it will basically update uh, its own uh, libraries, I guess. I don't know exactly what it is doing. We need some new, so few more time to set something up. Okay, so if it is long, I'll just uh, forward this. Okay, now we can see that uh, it is showing uh, start your but bot uh, bottles. Okay, now you can start your bottles. So now what you need to do is that uh, you need to click on this uh, create new bottle. So after clicking this create new bottle, uh, we need to create some uh, new environment. So uh, now uh, let's say, mm, okay, let's give some name, uh, which is called uh, something like Mm, Dave, we are just creating an environment. Okay, so we are just uh, I'm not using this application for gaming. So I'm um, uh, sorry choosing only application so application button here. Okay, after that, I'll leave everything as default and then I'll create it. Okay, generating bottle configuration and the wine configuration is being updated. Okay, so it will take a little bit of time. <coughs> okay. It could take a while. Okay. Okay, so now you can see apply CMD uh, setting changes. Okay, so bottle is totally cool than wine. Okay, because uh, if your system is so uh, fast or if your system having a uh, about good resources then you can actually use bottle so that uh, it will not use your whole uh, cpu okay it will not eat your whole cpu okay <coughs> optimizing environment and uh, uh, if you heard any background noise i'm really sorry for that okay so it, it is just creating one environment and uh, it is downloading uh, some this one okay let's wait for that Okay, now we are done with the what creating environment. I'll close this. So now you can see there is one, bo one button popping out which is called application. I'll click on that application and then you can see uh, this application pops out. <coughs> okay, so if I just run the execution, uh, be aware of sandbox. Bottle is running in the sandbox and restricted permission environment needed to keep up the safe. Okay. 
that's nice and uh, okay so now we need to uh, what so if i click on here so basically we used a telegram channel to run using uh, with the help of uh, what wine but now we are uh, using uh, one more new application which is called bottle with we'll just try to open the telegram again okay now i'll click on the telegram and uh, we'll run it L launching telegram okay it will take a little bit of time i guess so it is uh what okay setup is ready okay let's see the telegram will open now i guess yeah it's here <laughs> that's cool you know okay so i click on uh, okay and then uh, okay i'll click on next i'll click on next so that uh, okay so this is how you can use a bottle application to run windows application this is windows application don't get confused so i'll show you when i open file manager and when i go for downloads see here so th this is the windows application which i'm running that will be uh which exiting sorry uh, ending with the uh, dot exe so i can't run windows application in ubuntu so i'm using this a uh, bottle application and then i'm finishing it now it will uh what open the telegram channel sorry telegram application okay so you can see your telegram app has been uh, launched so this is how you can uh, what use a bottle application to install any windows application and uh, thank you for watching bye